Dear students, welcome back to the video and in this video you are going to learn about a very important topic of biology for class metric. So let's see what is the topic of today. The topic is in front of you on your screen. So we will discuss about the urinary system of human. And in this you are going to learn about parts of the urinary system and functions of various parts that are making the urinary system. So let's start the video. Well, first thing first, what is the urinary system? Well, this system consists of all the organs that are involved in the formation and storage and excretion of the urine. Well, the question must be popping up in your mind that what is urine? Well, the urine is basically the mixture of excess water that is not required by our body. And in that water, we are having nitrogenous waste products. These are the major toxins that are produced by our body like urea, uric acid, creatinine, as well as there are certain minerals which are not required by our body, they are in excess, and certain other compounds. So they make urine. And this urine is synthesized by the help of urinary system. Now you'll see the main components, the main organs that are forming this system in human actually. So there are three main organs that are forming the system. And first thing first is our kidneys. The first major organ is our kidneys. So we are having a pair of kidneys, then we are having a pair of tubular structure which is the ureters and then we are having the bag like structure which is known as the urinary bladder. So these three main organs are making our urinary system. So first we are starting from the main organ of the urinary system and these are your kidneys. So if you look at your kidneys then kidneys uh, these are bean shaped structures and they have the nephrons which are the filtration units and they are actually producing the urine in the kidneys. Okay, if you look at uh, the color of this uh, kidney then these kidneys are somewhat reddish brown in color and this structure uh, is present in the center. They are having a concavity uh, which is termed as hilus and hilus is that point from where renal artery, renal vein, as well as the ureters, they are finding their passage uh, to enter and to leave the kidney. Uh, if you consider the location of these kidneys, then these are located at the dorsal side. Dorsal side is the back side of the body and they are lying inside the abdominal cavity, the lower abdominal cavity above the waistline. Okay. So I hope that you understood it and both of these kidneys are facing the vertebral column. So this is basically the location of the kidney and you can see the real arteries entering the kidney and this is uh, the branch that is coming from the dorsal aorta. Okay and it is supplying uh, the oxygenated blood to the kidney so that the kidney can get its energy and can perform its function and in turn it produces deoxygenated blood so that deoxygenated blood goes from the kidney back to the heart to renal vein and renal vein then becomes a part of the inferior vena cava that takes the blood back to the heart's right atrium so uh, this is all about kidney now come to the pipes or the tubes that are coming from the kidney so we are having a pair of ureters right ureter and the left ureter they are just bringing up the urine from the kidneys and then they are bringing it bringing it to the urinary bladder they are draining this urine into the urinary bladder if you look at your bladder then this is a bag pouch or sac like a structure which is uh, made of thin membrane which is elastic so uh, this again consists of various parts so the first part this part is apex and we are having the body of this urinary bladder and in the center we are having a triangular area which is known as trigon trigon is having three holes and two holes are from uh, these two ureters and then we are having the neck part of the urinary bladder and then in the, f in the last we are having uh, the urethra so the urine that is coming to the urinary bladder is stored for a certain time period and after that 
it is excreted or expelled out of the body through urethra which is a very narrow tube that uh, excretes the urine outside the body so i hope that you got this simple structure of uh, the urinary system so in this video you learned all about uh, different organs that are making the urinary system now you'll see the functions of organs of urinary system though you know them but you'll uh, just revise what are the functions so kidneys filter the blood and produce urine and how are they producing it with the help of the nephrons that are making the whole kidney then we are having ureters the ureters pass the urine from kidneys to urinary bladder so they are acting as a passage for urine then we are having urinary bladder that is towards urine and urethra which passes the urine outside of the body i hope that you understood it if you like this video hit the like button subscribe to the channel thanks for watching and stay tuned to this channel for more new videos thanks for your support and if you have any query you can ask in the comment i will see you in some other informative video with some other informative topic till then take care